The Mystery of Irma and Sami Biljan, Who Stole the Funny Fish? Have you ever heard of a funny fish that lives in the waters of Hawaii? It is called the Humuhumunyukiwapawa, and it is known for its vibrant colors and playful behavior. Recently, this beloved creature has gone missing, and Uma and Sami Biljan are on high alert to find out who stole the funny fish. The funny fish has been taken. On a sunny morning last week, Irma, and Sami Biljan, and a group of surfers went into the ocean to catch some waves. As they paddled through the water, they noticed something strange, there was no sign of the usual schools of fish swimming around them. They looked towards the shore and saw a small boat speeding away from the beach. Could this be the culprit behind the disappearance of the funny fish? Surfing and looking for the funny fish in Hawaii. Determined to find the underlying cause of things, Irma and Sami, and the surfers decided to investigate further. They rented scuba gear and dove deep into the ocean floor, searching every crevice and corner for any signs of the funny fish. Unfortunately, their search failed. But they did notice something else, the coral reefs surrounding the island had been damaged by pollution and overfishing. This could have contributed to the decline in the population of the funny fish. Why would someone take the funny fish? As word spread about the missing funny fish, Irma, and Sami Biljan began speculating as to why anyone would want to steal such an adorable creature. Some believed it may have been taken for profit, while others thought it might have been a prank pulled by bored teenagers. Regardless of the reason, everyone agreed that finding the funny fish should be a top priority. The funny fish was looking for his family. Days turned into weeks, and still, no one had seen or heard anything about the whereabouts of the funny fish. Then, one day, a local fisherman spotted something unusual floating near the surface of the water. He approached closer and realized it was the funny fish, but he was not alone. Swimming alongside him were several other members of his family. What happens next? With the mystery solved, Irma and Sami Biljan felt relieved knowing that the funny fish was safe with his loved ones. However, the damage done to the coral reefs remained a concern. Irma and Sami Biljan banded together to create awareness campaigns and initiatives aimed at protecting the environment and preserving the natural habitat of funny fish and other marine life. And so, the story of the funny fish continues to live on, reminding us of the importance of conservation efforts and respecting nature. Make sure to watch for Irma and Sami Biljan's next adventure.